As you probably know, the world is facing a number of crises, climate change, biodiversity loss, but also raging inequality, just to name a few. Innovation can and does impact all of these. My research is on one of the proposed solutions to the sustainability crisis that we're facing, the bioeconomy. In Sweden, I look at how innovation in the past 50 years has been developed to come closer to an economy that doesn't rely on fossil fuels for its energy and products. What my research shows is that even though there has been a lot of activity in recent decades, other areas have grown. Collaboration might be an important way to address this and increase the number of innovation across the world. But at the same time, the system has been very focused on a production mode which focuses on extracting materials and treating forests as the intensified resource base for its production. This is a global phenomenon and as such a solution won't just occur from one country. What studying innovation highlights is that in highly advanced societies that is a major level of change. So by looking at innovation we can ask a lot of questions and open conversations about the past, the present and the future of how we want to live and how we can live in a way that hopefully is less intense on our planet and kinder to each other.